Well, we have a little system problem here that I'm trying to solve. Uh, we had some planters that were being fed by a drip system that have now been removed, and now the drip, drip system feed pipe, just here, has now been... Um, uh, I've opened it up, I want to see where it goes and where it connects to the rest of the system. So, I've used my Pro 65 and fed the uh, fed the lead wire in as far as it will go, and I was able to determine there were a couple of places along the way where drips are attached. Uh, you can feel it as you go, go past them with the uh, push rod from the Pro 65. So I've pushed it in there, and I am going to see what I can do. Our basic idea is to use it like a locator. I'm going to connect red to red and black to a ground stake. This is my locator, it's turned on. I'm turning it on to direct high frequency. Let's stick it on level two just for good measure. Now I'm going to turn on my wand and move it to high frequency. Tell it to start, run up the volume a little bit, sensitivity. Okay, so. Sanity check. Yep, I've got the tone going on. So now, I want to determine where this pipe went. So I am, I'm going to treat it like I was locating a, a wire. Now well, there's the, I'm going to turn the sensitivity down even. There's the null. So I've got a pretty good track going on here. There's the null. It's not very deep. I could switch it to peak and track it. It's almost easier that way because I can just walk along and treat it like a metal detector almost. It goes here obviously to this planter and uh, there is a drip system in the planter with one of those 5 8 tubes. So I'm going to go back to null mode. Except the so I've managed to track it to this area here. So now what I want to do is actually locate. I have pushed that the yellow rod from the Pro 65 in about as far as it'll go, which I think probably means a tease in here. So I am going to go back and change. Here's my track again. This is a piece of vinyl pipe I would never have been able to do anything with. Okay, and uh, here's something you should never try at home. Never move the leads on a live locator, but I have got big insulated crock clips and so I'm feeling okay about it. So what I have done now is connected this in the closed loop mode. So I've got the locator signal applied, applied across the... And as you see, I get out here when it's in closed loop mode, there's no signal. There's nothing happening here. This is what happens when you get in the closed loop mode, all the signals absorb. But when it gets to the coil that's at the end of the Pro 65, we should hear a peak. Yep, so right here, I know if I dig right here, I'm going to find my pipe. That actually worked pretty well. I was able to use a switch, a switching modes. I used the null mode when I got over here to try to locate the... Yeah, I get a much better kind of a triangulation. That, that works pretty well. So now I know this piece of vinyl pipe runs under the rocks here and um, connects to the rest of the drip system here, rather than over there or around the, the periphery of the yard.